हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई वेलकम यू इन लेक्चर नंबर एट ऑन हायर ऑर्डर पार्शियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस सो फार वी वर डिस्कसिंग होमोजीनियस लीनियर पार्शियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस विद कांस्टेंट कोऑफिशिएंट्स एंड वी हैव सीन दैट इफ आवर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इज होमोजीनियस देन वी कैन राइट इट इन द फॉर्म फंक्शन ऑफ डी डी डैश टाइम्स जेड इक्वल टू जीरो सो दिस इक्वेशन इज होमोजीनियस एंड वी हैव सीन how to obtain general solution for homogeneous linear pde with constant coefficients now from this lecture onwards we are going to consider non homogeneous linear pde with constant coefficients that means we will have some non zero function on the right hand side say function of x and y so here f is not identically equal to 0 and that makes this equation non homogeneous we are already familiar with uh, methods of solving non homogeneous linear ordinary differential equations with constant coefficients and the method for partial differential equations is also analogous to the method of solving higher order non homogeneous ordinary differential equations if you recall for non homogeneous ordinary differential equations which are linear and with constant coefficients we have seen that general solution is nothing but addition of complementary function and particular integral or particular solution where this complementary function is the general solution of corresponding homogeneous ordinary differential equation so here also we will have the same method here also uh, we have to decide the complementary function as well as particular solution or particular integral so the theory for linear ordinary differential equations of higher order and partial linear differential equations of higher order is analogous so we can easily understand Uh, this uh, method for solving non homogeneous pdes if we are familiar with the methods of solving non homogeneous linear odes with constant coefficients uh, if you have not seen those methods for linear odes then i have a lecture series on higher order ordinary differential equations which you can watch and learn before going for higher order partial differential equations because here we are going to generalize the things which we have done for the case of ordinary differential equations now here our aim is to understand the method for solving non homogeneous linear partial differential equation with constant coefficients which we can always write in the symbolic form f of d d dash z equal to f x y so here to solve this equation suppose we denote this by number 1 to solve this non homogeneous equation first step is to find out the general solution of corresponding homogeneous linear differential equation so we consider right hand side equal to 0 and we write down the corresponding homogeneous linear differential equation and we know how to find out general solution of this type of equation up to this lecture uh, we have discussed the methods for solving homogeneous linear pde with constant coefficients so we will find out the general solution of corresponding homogeneous linear partial differential equation and general solution of this equation number 2 is called complementary function of given non homogeneous equation so to solve non homogeneous linear pde we have to first solve the corresponding homogeneous linear pde and the general solution of that homogeneous linear pde is known as complementary function of given non homogeneous linear pde after finding complementary function of given equation we are interested in the particular solution of given equation which is free from arbitrary functions 
we have to decide one particular solution of equation number one which is free from arbitrary functions so that particular solution is also known as particular integral so after finding complementary function we have to find out the particular solution of given non homogeneous equation that particular solution is called particular integral of given equation 1 and we are going to discuss different methods for finding this particular solution or particular integral of this non homogeneous equation and once we are able to decide particular integral the general solution of given non homogeneous linear pd with constant coefficients is addition of complementary function and particular integral now we are able to decide complementary function because we have discussed the methods for solving homogeneous linear pds with constant coefficients so we have to understand that how to obtain particular integral of this type of non homogeneous linear pd with constant coefficients now if you observe this equation then solution means the value of dependent variable z or the value of unknown function z which satisfies this equation 1 so from this we can rewrite this equation as z equal to 1 over this function of d d dash operated on the right hand side function fx y so this value of z is our particular solution or particular integral so how to obtain particular integral that is our question from this lecture onwards now there are different methods for particular integral as in the case of linear ods with constant coefficients we will discuss them one by one so we have shortcut methods for finding particular integrals and those shortcut methods are applicable for particular functions on the right hand sides if our function fx y is say exponential function or sine or cosine or suppose it is a rational function which has this type of terms then only we can apply shortcut methods but if we are familiar with those shortcut methods then it is very easy to decide particular solution if our function on the right hand side satisfies the criteria of shortcut methods so first our focus will be on the shortcut methods for particular integral and then we will see one general method for particular integral so this is all about this non homogeneous linear pds with constant coefficients which we can always write in symbolic form as ftd dash z equal to fx y to find out the general solution of this equation first we have to solve the corresponding homogeneous linear differential equation and solution of this equation is called complementary function of this equation after finding complementary function we have to find out one particular solution of given equation and then by adding these two we have to write down the general solution of given equation so i have written all these things systematically non homogeneous linear pds with constant coefficients this is the symbolic form where f is a non zero function of x and y which makes this equation non homogeneous to find the general solution of this equation number 1 first solve the corresponding homogeneous pd f d d z equal to 0 general solution of this equation 2 is called the complementary function of given equation after finding complementary function we find the particular solution of given equation given by number 1 and that particular solution is also known as particular integral and the general solution of given equation is then given by addition of complementary function and particular integral 
so there are different methods for finding the particular integral or particular solution and uh, first we will discuss shortcut methods for finding particular integral so for particular integral we can write from this equation that z is 1 over f d d dash f x y that is the general formula for particular integral and shortcut methods for particular integral are for some special functions on the right hand sides and those special right hand sides we will consider as exponential function sin or cosine and uh, when each term of f x y is of the form x raised to m times y raised to n that is we have algebraic function which each of which terms contains powers of x and y so this is all about this session in next lecture we will discuss shortcut methods for finding particular integral i hope you like this lecture thanks for watching